Hello everybody, I'm back with my February favorites today and I'm really excited because I have a lot of stuff to share with you, especially a lot of, oh, the boys are just sleeping in my bedroom. <laughs> I have a lot of stuff to share with you, especially for the boys, so stay tuned until the end because that's usually when I do the toddlers and kid kind of stuff. Okay, I'm gonna go quickly. My new favorite item, you guys know I am always, always thirsty, and I lost my water bottle. I think I even vlogged the day I lost it, but I've been using this Camelback one, and I go through three or four of these a day of water. I just can't get enough, and it's nice to have this on the go as well because, you know, I'm in the house, I'm out of the house, I'm in the car a ton because I'm always commuting to Will's preschool and to our house that we're building and all that, so this has been great, and I got this from Target. It. And also a lot of you always ask me where I get things so I'll have things listed down below so you can look it up because I know that every place is different There's not always the same stores, so I'll just list the product name um, so you can check it out there The next item is something that I have talked about before and I've been using it a ton Recently, and I just love it and it's the Garnier Fructis style uh, New deconstructed texture teas dry touch finish spray with micro mineral powder holy cow huge name Okay, I wasn't sure what I would think about this because I was like, I have thick hair, I don't need a ton of texture, but this is a couple dollars, so I was like, I'll try it anyway. I love this because you know those days where your hair is just too clean almost, and it just kind of is slippery and really silky smooth, almost too much? This helps give it more body, this helps give it more life, especially when you curl it. My hair was kind of curled today, but then it's snowing outside behind me, so that kind of made it wet. But this is awesome, especially because it's only a couple of dollars. This next one was something I was really, really excited to try, and I got this when I was vlogging, when I went to Target, but it's the Simple Cleansing Micellar Water. And this is what I've been using. I'm gonna do an updated skincare routine coming up here. This is amazing at getting makeup off. I know I keep telling you guys about different makeup removers, but this just takes the cake. This is just the best of the best. So when I have a full face of makeup like I do right now, I will just take a very large oval pad and just completely take off all my eye makeup, everything. And the reason why, I looked up micellar water and it talks about how uh, there's something in it that clings to dirt or something so it's like a magnet almost and it pulls it out and my skin is so clean so then I just wipe it off wipe my eyes everything and then I wash it and that's it my skin and then I kind of test it and like go over again with another cotton pad and there's nothing left on my skin so this is only a couple dollars as well and I found this at Target as well the next thing is a lip product and I have been absolutely loving this I'm all about keeping my lips moisturized all of the time especially in the winter and this is a lip balm from Kiehl's I've talked about the regular version before that my sister gave me a year ago but I got this recently the last couple of months and it's the mango scent and you know me I love mango I love coconut I love anything tropical this stuff is incredible on your lips it is so soothing it smells incredible and it just moisturizes your lips so you don't have dry lips especially now because it's winter the next thing is a lip combo that I'm wearing right now, and a lot of you guys have been asking me what I have been wearing in all of my daily vlogs. So the first thing is this. It is a new, um, new to me, <laughs> Revlon, let's see, Balm Stain in the color Honey. I know everybody's raving about this right now on YouTube, but it's just a really beautiful color as you can see, and it's just really, really natural. And I've been wearing it with this, and this is the NYX Butter Glass that you guys all know that I love in the color Tiramisu, which is very similar in color to the Honey. So together, you get this look. So really simple, not messy, really natural looking, but I love it. And on the same lines as being natural, you guys saw in a vlog on Valentine's Day how I went and got my makeup done at the MAC counter and I asked the guy Tony, he was so sweet. So I asked Tony about any foundations that MAC had that would be super natural for me, nothing, something that I could build but nothing too thick or too cakey. And he recommended this to me and it's the MAC Studio Face and Body Foundation and it is in the color C2, I believe, but he matched it perfectly to my skin and he said you could seriously put 10 layers of this on and it wouldn't look cakey and it's so true. I just put one layer on and it's basically acting like, you know, a BB cream, but it's luminous. It makes my skin look natural. I, I just really like it. I just like it, so thanks, Tony. And then last but not least for my makeup items, I got this a couple months ago and it's just wood winked and I love this because it's just an all over beautiful bronzy color that I just put all over my eyes. And a lot of you have also been asking my daily vlogs, like 
what my daily makeup routine is, so I'm gonna do an updated one of that as well. So it's also funny because I started using a shampoo and conditioner that I used literally 10 years ago. So in 2005, I went on a study abroad to Spain, and I remember my sister-in-law, who does hair, she recommended this to me, and I took it there because it was really humid, and I wanted something really good and soothing and smoothing and nourishing for my hair, and she recommended this. It's the Matrix uh, Sleek Line, and my friend Percy, who does my hair, she said there was like a two for 20 deal, and so I got it, and I got these two huge liters for $20. And I, this is just such an oldie, but a goodie, and it's so nostalgic when I use it, but it really, really does a good job of making my hair nourished and conditioned and smell incredible. And it makes your hair really clean and really sleek, hence the sleek line. I've never done this before, but I actually got pumps on my huge liters. Usually I just have this huge liter and I'm like pouring it. So thanks to my sister-in-law for recommending this to me 10 years ago, and thanks to Percy for getting it to me on time. Okay, this last item for me is just this tumbler. This is the Aladdin brand, and I got this a year or two ago. I cannot drink out of normal glasses anymore. We are so weird. Brad and I were like, should we just get rid of all of our glasses and cups in our house? Because we just drink from tumblers all day long. We love drinking with straws, and you can just put a lot more in it, and it won't spill like a glass will or break like a glass will. So this I also got at Target a couple years ago. So that has been awesome. I am sorry about the lighting, it just keeps changing on me. There's like so much light going on even though it's snowing, so <laughs> I apologize about that. So one last thing for me, and I will have probably already talked about this in my fitness routine video, but I have been loving, loving the Pregnancy Project by Tracy Anderson. This is a nine DVD set pregnancy workout program that I have just been in love with. It gives you a good burn, it's really good for toning, and she's pregnant as well. So I've just been loving, loving this. This has just been my saving grace on days where I feel like I wanna get a really good workout and not just like something super easy. Now for the boys and what they've been loving. I went to, one of my new things is just going to the dollar store with them and just they think it's so fun and so exciting because it's like all this stuff, but it's a dollar. So we are in church for three hours every Sunday, and sometimes that can be kind of long. Um, usually the first two hours, the boys are in their nursery and their primary classes, so they're not just sitting there in the same room for three hours, but and they can play with toys or whatever. But the last hour, which is sacrament meeting, is kind of long. So I always like to switch up and bring books, and I got these coloring books from the dollar store and you guys know they love rescue bots so they like freaked out when we saw this and then this one's like big and easy because my boys have been obsessed with coloring lately especially Willie. So this is just at the dollar store so if you are ever in those situations where you need some coloring material a dollar and it's an entire book instead of like printing out page by page. Another thing I don't have it with me right here is like I said before we have just been so in love and obsessed with coloring. I know I get in trouble when I say the word obsessed, but that's the true word. That's how I really feel, you guys. <laughs> but my boys have been loving coloring and I've been loving these little Ikea containers that I got a long time, time ago um, to, just to put the markers in. And it's really good because it closes and it fits all of the markers and then they can just color and use it and they love it. And it's just a really good organizing thing. And I also put in chalk in a different one and crayons in another. So it's just a really good container. I think it's like three for a dollar ninety nine or something super cheap like that. And then I have a book that the boys have been loving and I think I've talked about this before but it's A Treasury of Curious George and it's eight stories and they love Curious George. They call him Monkey George and we just read this all of the time. Last night I read four of these stories to them. It's like a good half an hour and it put them to sleep. Like they were so tired by the end of the day, but it was really, really fun. When we have been painting a lot, we've needed a lot of paper and sometimes you can't just use normal paper because paint will you know, leak through or whatever. So I got this at Target and it's the Paint and Marker Pad. It's heavyweight and acid free and it's just plain paper, but it's really thick and so they can just paint to their little hearts content on this thicker paper that won't leak through. Okay, the last item is something kind of silly, but the boys have really, really loved it. I've had this for years, but they have recently discovered it and they just use it all the time. But it's a stool from Ikea and I'm trying to think of how much this costs. I want to say like $6.99 or something. So it's really lightweight, has the grippies on the bottom and on the top, but since the boys don't have their normal um, island seating like we did in our old house, they can't really see what's going on in the kitchen. So they take this stool all over the house when they can't reach things, they go grab it upstairs, they come downstairs, they take it to the bathroom when they're brushing their teeth. They just really love these stools and so, we, I think I'm gonna get another one so we can have two of them in our other house and so they can have one, you know, 
upstairs, downstairs, whatever, but it's been a really good resource when they want to help me cook. They can see what's going on without having to sit on the counters and all of that. So that is it for my February favorites. Thumbs up if you loved this video and thumbs up if you're having a great day. I will have, once again, linked down below everything that I talked about, the names of it, and then you can Google it and find out because sometimes where I find something somewhere, you might not be able to. So if you have the name, then you can find it <laughs> for yourselves. Anyway, I love you all so very much. Have, hope you're having a great day and we will see you all next month in my next video. And I'm really excited because Molly's coming so soon. Woo! I love it. Comment down below and tell me something. Tell me something. What should I say? What should we say? What should you tell me? Tell me something good that has happened to you today. Tell me something positive. Let's be positive. Tell me something good. Okay. All right. Okay. Bye.